Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of FTL. But this time, there's been a new update for the game, uh, which is enabling about... Uh, <coughs> it's enabling Advanced Mode, or Advanced Edition. Yeah, let's start a new game. Advanced Edition Content. Now what this does is it adds about... It adds like two or three more modules in the game. Uh, I know a ton more weapons uh, and a new race and a new ship. And I'm not entirely sure if the Type C was in the game before. But yeah. So I've unlocked a little bit more stuff this time around. But um... Alright. So, to unlock the next ship, we gotta do that. So, but I've never had a victory before. So, let's just go with an Ingi ship. Well, do we want to go with an Ingi ship? I have no clue. I think we're just gonna need to go with the Kestrel. We're just gonna go. We got Grafen. We got Grafen. We got Bars. And we got Rebecca. Rebecca needs to be black. No, I'm just... <laughs> oh, already racist joke. Um, my my apologies, everyone. Okay. So, boom, boom. Out of the med bay into the engine, and let's let us go forth to claim what is ours. Make sure everything's plugged in here. Jump to an empty spot in space. Well, isn't that just great? Oh, no. Of course, this would be like... Charge your weapons. You can still charge them. Oh, well. Uh, well, let's just hit the burst laser. We're not going to need to fire any missiles. Oh, well, they just hit me with a missile, so screw you. How do you like a missile into your weapon system, loser? Just disable that cloaking. Oh, you little bastard. Oh, their cloaking just went down. Oh, well. Oh, we got a fire. Well, the easiest way to handle this is for you to get out of there. And then let's just flush the oxygen out of there. Well, let's just wait and see if we can jump next time there's about to be a solar flare. Fire should be going out without oxygen. No repressurize. Get yeah, okay. We're gonna move. No. Mm -hmm. Let's really hope I don't find anything. Stay out of this, or you'll be the next one we concentrate fire on. Ignore it. Okay. We don't. Sorry, we don't have time. <laughs> no, we might have had oxygen in that room fast enough. So I don't know. You get another bar of energy, so I can always have my med bay on. It's not imperative that you always have your med bay on. It's really pointless to even waste it in the med bay when you're not using it, I guess. But I prefer having it always on. I don't know. It's kind of helpful. No, we can't. We can't go f help with giant space alien spiders. Sorry about that. I will have to read those allowed to people. We'll have to read it, let everybody know. What's detected an automated rebel scout attacking the small refueling outpost. Should we intervene to defend it? Or avoid the conflict? We're gonna intervene to defend it. We're going to intervene so hardcore. Just intervene so hard they don't even know. They don't even know. Boom. And our weapons! Down again! Dude, they n always shoot our weapons with a missile. I don't understand this. Gosh. Only 9 scrap, 15 scrap from that. Well, alright, that's cheap reward, guys. Come on now. Oh, well. 
It's not the reward, it was just helping, you know. No, we came here for scrap, that was the entire point. Uh, oh, look, another distress beacon! Hail them to offer assistance. Our shields are down, we won't last long. Don't risk your ship, leave them to the fate, try to shield their ship with yours. Yay! Ow. <laughs> that never works, unless you have, like, a rock ship or something like that. Three fuel for three drones. I don't have drones, so I'm not going to accept that. Is there a store anywhere? Missile weapon. Offer to solve their problem. Creating a supply mining explosive run out of every missile rubber bucket. Do you have any extras? Give them the request of five missiles. Or offer to solve their problem by launching a missile. Well, we appreciate your enthusiasm. We have certain protocols for these explosives around the workplace. Launching a military-grade weapon into our mines isn't exactly what we call union-friendly. Uh, yeah, I'll give them some. Yay, they repaired my hull for it. I I don't I don't really like missiles, so it's not that big of a deal to me. But we might need the missile for now. Like, actually, that might have been a really friggin' bad idea to do just. Get rid of the far missile right there. Buy one slave to join them or attack the slaver scum. Hmm. You recognize the ship as a well-known slave trader. He offers you laborers for cheap. Huh. I'll buy one slave. You're not a slave anymore. Operate the shields, loser. Or you'll never get out of here alive. I mean, uh, <clears throat> please join our crew and uh, become friends with us. Yeah, that's it. Uh, dual shot laser increases in cooldown. Decreases in cooldown. The more it fires after three volumes, it only takes seven seconds to charge. Seven seconds. Ugh. Okay. How much damage does it do? One, and it shoots two times, and uh, I, I would not even have enough to get. I don't have enough to get it. So, we'll buy fuel and a missile. Oh, no, can't buy a missile. Well, well guess I'll have to come back to the shop. Or check that one out after this distress beacon, see if I can get a bunch of scrap, buy something useful. Try to dislodge the shot, fire a few volleys, takes a beating, but it eventually pulls free, and they thank you for your assistance. Alright. To the new store. Rock tolerant, okay, whatever. Ooh, a burst laser. I can't sell this. I get it, but I want the, a burst laser. I want it. I want it, I want it. <clears throat> but I don't want to get screwed over and die either, so... Minute fissures in the shield spark and crackle as the ship jumps into the wake of a huge asteroid. More asteroids follow, as does the, a lost and aggressive rock pirate ship. Oh, You just gotta be so aggressive. See, he has a scrap thrower. If you look, oh, like, right there on the enemy ship. Yeah, see how they shot that little clump? It's the best at destroying modules. Of course it hit my weapons. Obviously it's going to hit my weapons, but it's the best at destroying modules. So, you know. The ship might just get torn up by the asteroids. Yeah. Oh my gosh. They just always attack that... Now I can go back and get another burst laser. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go back and get another burst laser. It's probably gonna be a really, really bad idea, but I'm just like mixing it up right now. I'm just experimenting right now. So, oh, not enough system power. I am a genius. I thought it would only take one because it was a Mach 1 and then the Mach 2 takes two, you know, Mach 3 takes four, you know, but no, no, obviously. The fight with the Rebels, this is our breach missiles. Alright, I don't, I don't have enough power to run a breach missile. But, 
thanks. But, you know, I could sell it and then upgrade. So, yeah. And then upgrade to so that I can use my other thing. Oh, Rebecca is harmed. She gets hurt in every fight because they always nail her in the face with explosives. Like, she is like a boss or something. She has to be a boss. I'm gonna go to this distress signal, then the store. Let's do someone to fall into our dastardly trap. <sighs> you dastardly ragamuffins, you. Um, let's see, let's think of a word for these, for these, uh, these rapscallions. These. God dang it. <laughs> Just something stupid. Don't don't listen to me. Well, all right. <laughs> they hit our weapon system, guys. This is not going good at all. You know you notice that? Oh, we're probably gonna die. And the shields were fully repaired and yay. Just hit our weapons again. Okay, you know what? Screw this. Okay, screw engines, right, for now. Oh, great. No, we can't depressurize that by doing that, because... Okay. <laughs> Need to put out the oxygen and fix it. Only if... We're gonna die. Already. I can already tell. Operate the dang thing. Thank you. Well, isn't that just amazing? They just hit our sensors. And our doors. So we can't remotely control door systems. We can only manually open them with a person. But we don't really want to do that. Oh my god. Actually, sorry, Bars. You're gonna have to just suck it up and go. Just like, fix the oxygen. Yeah, we're dead. One more shot and we're dead. Yeah, we're dead. There's no way. We got one hit left, and they just took us out with that. Boom. Oh my gosh. Yeah, let's go to the hangar. Let's turn it on. Easy, yeah. Okay. To a store! Away. Continue. Uh, Zoltan Shield Bypass. Advanced FTL. Allows the ship to jump to any previously visited beacon. Okay. Like, don't have to be connecting. Let's see page two. Could get a rock guy. I don't know. Let's see. No, I wouldn't have enough if I just sold that. So... I would love to have a rock guy, but, you know, whatever. This game just wants to screw me over. Right as I look up and find this beautiful thing sitting right here. It's just so beautiful. I don't... It's without fathom. Okay. Um, so if I say, boom, wait, no, 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 no. Boom into that. I could then power this burst laser. Mark three, yeah. Boom. That charges at an okay pace. Let's see, how many times does it shoot? Five shots per charge. That is not bad. I will give I will give it credit for that. 
The infinitely long charge, though. Yeah, let's attack the slaver, scum. Not enough system power to engage? Okay, well. Boom. No. Oh, it has a whole beam and an EMP. Or, uh, not an It is pretty much an EMP, but it's ion. It will take out my shields. And then he'll go to town on me with a whole laser, yeah. Alright. See, all five smacked right into him. Dude, I need another one of these. Just like two of them. Weapon precharger, just jump in and light them up. That'd be amazing. Ooh, I'll take it. He offered me, in exchange for his life, a slave. And it was an Ingi. Which is pretty much like a geth from Mass Effect. If you're, you know, I have Mass Effect videos on my channel. If you don't know what a geth is, go watch that. But yeah. So now that I have an NG on my team, just completely downpower the engines. So that, boom. Go heal this person. Boom. We have a shield operator, which makes our shields recharge faster, which is great. Now I need to save my current crew positions so that after a crisis or a fight or whatever, you know, we have to scatter them around to repair, we can just all send them back to the same station. Every damaged Federation ship is hiding in a nebula at this beacon before you have time to make contact with them. Attempt to follow them and help them. Oh, I can't pick them up. Oh, well, I couldn't find them. <coughs> oh, no. Well, okay, that's it. All right, well. Pirate controlled or pilot pirate controlled? Well, let's. I guess I'm gonna have to choose pirate controlled. Mm, yeah. Well, last <clears throat> word region was thrown into chaos at the start of a rebellion. Even in peacetime. Even in peacetime. Peacetime. Even in peacetime. Even in peacetime, everybody. I'm gonna give you some of my peacetime. I know that for sure. Gosh. Even in peacetime, guys. Even in peacetime. No! Not the doors! Not the doors! Not the bees! Okay. Oh my god, a meteor hit our weapon system! Mm. I don't even know. Yeah, you two... Oh my god. Okay, well. Actually, activate the Artemis. We're getting wrecked again. Thank you. Turn to crew saved physicians. Oh, our doors are hacked. Wow, I didn't. Wow, me and my big mouth, right? We're gonna take this kid out. Well, his shields are down, so it's probably gonna get annihilated. Alrighty, so. <clears throat> Just gonna finish this kid off. Boom. Sensors are down. So uh, I'm gonna take Declan over here. It's gonna go repair that. I should not have done that, but who cares? I do a lot actually. <laughs> Alrighty. Now that sensors are fully operational. We can get back to the weapons, turn power to the engines, and we can go off into destiny. Rangers scans indicate there are no life forms aboard. You salvage anything useful, but no find a clue of the former crew. A clue as to where the former crew might have been. Mm. Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, no, I'm, I'm sorry, guys. Um, 
So. Need to upgrade this at one point. I'm gonna need to upgrade this first. Okay. I'm gonna upgrade my shields before my weapons. Oh crap. Cause that well, I guess I'm going through the nebula now. Hmm. It's worrying that the rebels have penetrated so deep into uncharted space. Okay. NOT MY MAD BAY! No, okay. Maybe? I might be regretting that in a minute. Maybe. Oh, my med bay is destroyed. Your weapons are down, good sir. What you can do now? Nothing. You're gonna sit there and take it. Say, ooh, auto hacker. Say, ooh. Okay. Well, I'm so glad I had to miss 50 times. I'm glad I'm glad I'm still being hacked, by the way. Well, uh, might as well aim for the hack. Alrighty. Let's see who's our best mechanic. Well, obviously Elizabeth. Why would Elizabeth not be? The, oh, and the engine operator is wounded, so might as well throw him in there as well and then give him power. And then return to saved career position. Now to upgrade thine ship. Need another power bar. Boom, double shield. So now we got two shields. Great. Heavy damage Federation ship is hiding in the nebula at this beacon before you have time to make contact with them, they fade into the nebula. I'm gonna go looking for them again. My search is hopeless. Again, wow. Maybe I need upgraded sensors for that. An especially well-armed pirate ship approaches you. Hand over one of your crew members and the rest of you can go free, unharmed. Draw straws and send a crew member over to the slavers, or we will never surrender to one, uh, one of our own two crew slavers. Uh, whatever. We will never surrender. Obviously. Well, this is gonna be fun. Mr. Zoltan Shield over here. Um. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and say. We're almost done with this video. <laughs> So, good thing the shields are now down. Now we shall aim for the own weapons. Ah, oh, my own weapons. Okay. We'll just charge up a lower level laser. We will accept him. You shall man the door systems. Such a glorious job, isn't it? Compared to all the other good good jobs on this ship, you know? Okay. Well, I don't sense we're gonna make it very far anyway, so <laughs> 
I'm not gonna hire anyone. Tell them offer it. Try to steal the ship of mine. Yeah. Oh my God. Fuel though. Preve preventing them from being entirely destroyed, but your ship took a number of hits in the process. They offer some scrap and fuel they're mining out of the asteroids. Awesome. Okay. Okay. I could upgrade doors if I really want. <laughs> I'm going to upgrade weapon. Excuse me. Well, well, don't know if I picked that up, but if it did, excuse me. Check the automated ship to get to the storage. Well, alright. Oh, crate. He has ion in a missile. That's a stupid combination. Okay, well, apparently it's going to be enough to kill my pathetic whelp of a... <clears throat> Alright, flak gun. Hmm. I don't know. It's the insector. Well, I don't think we're gonna. We're doing terrible. So you know what I'm gonna do? Go back to the hangar. All right. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna play the Zoltan Cruiser this time around. Okay. Ugh. So I'm gonna name I'm gonna name each of these guys too. Let's see. So we got Andrew Finn here. <clears throat> no, okay, uh <laughs> gonna name him Puffy. And puffy. Yeah. Oh yeah. Name this one. The Dash. Okay. And this one. It's gonna be his name's gonna be Fane. No? No? Fabe apparently. Fane. Okay. And this isn't gonna be the adjudicator. Adjudicate is that the adjudicator? The adjudicator? I don't know what I want to name it. The Educator? I'm going to name it the Obliteratrix. Alright. So, thank you all for watching. And, uh, the Obliteratrix will go on its maiden voyage in the next episode. So, thank you all for watching, and stay vigilant.